Hi, I'm Alan. This is Bob with a couple of chefs from Aprons Cooking School. Bob, what are you making today? We're going to do a mole style chili. Holy mole. Yeah. All right. Beef and chocolate, man. Goes Can't go beautiful. wrong with that. Mole, and Alan knows this, but just to let you know, it's just like it's like a, a spicy chocolate sauce. It's a Mexican dish, and it's pretty cool, and we're going to do chili with that. In here, I just have some ground beef, and I have some onions cooking. No big deal. It's kind of fun. This is something where at home you can kind of go through the cabinet in the refrigerator. We'll put some pumpkin pie spice in there. Ooh. Why are we doing that? I don't know why. Because we can. There you because go. Because we can. A little pumpkin pie spice. We're going to put some chili, you know, package of chili powder that you buy. A little bit of that in there, if Alan would mix that around for gotcha, me. Bob. And uh, with the chili, you want to sweeten it up some. So we're going to take a little bit of brown sugar and throw Ooh. that in there. Okay, so now we've got a little uh, pumpkin pie spice, chili, all that cool stuff. Now we're going to add some really cool things to this that make it a little bit different. Some strong coffee. Nice strong coffee right in there with that. We're going to add some fire roasted tomatoes. We've talked about these a lot. We like these, any kind of chopped tomatoes, but these fire roasted tomatoes are really, really good. Now, whatever kind of beans you want, you know, right? Whatever sure. kind you want. We're going to use black beans with this because that's what the recipe calls for. Drain them. Definitely drain the beans because they could be salty. You know, we're going to drain the beans, put those in there. So then, it doesn't call for it, but you got to put some hot sauce in there. There you go. A little bit. I'm not using sriracha because it's a Mexican dish, so I'm putting a little chipotle Tabasco. Then we're going to add a little beef stock. And what you want to do is let this cook for about, it's chilly. Let it cook till it's done, you know, about 45 minutes. And at the very end, chocolate. Beautiful. That looks great, Bob. Well, thank you. Story tomorrow. Be sure to stop by our Publix Aprons kiosk, Simple Meals area, to pick up this beautiful recipe and all the ingredients that go with it. Good job, Bob. That looks great. Yeah, we're going to eat some. Absolutely.